starts now. Well, sports director Anthony Calhoun joins us as the state of Indiana has lost another basketball, basketball legend earlier today. And AC, yeah. if there was a Mount Rushmore of basketball players here in the Hoosier State, mm -hmm. George McGinnis would no doubt be on. Yeah, he would indeed. And what I loved about him, just the grace, just such a great guy. You ask anybody about him, they'll tell you just what a wonderful person he was, not only great on the basketball court, but just a great human being as well. Yeah, very disappointing news here today. Good evening to everybody. When you think of the Indiana Pacers and the ABA and NBA, one name that always comes up is the legendary George. George McGinnis, the Hall of Fame forward who was a two-time ABA champion and three-time All-Star in both the NBA and ABA, has died at the age of 73. Across the ABA and NBA, McGinnis had over 17,000 points, over 9,000 rebounds, and over 3,000 assists in his career, and was inducted into the Hall of Fame in 2017. Prior to turning pro, McGinnis was a superstar at Indiana, becoming the first sophomore to lead the Big Ten in scoring and rebounding on his way to third team All-America honors. Patriots head coach Rick Carlisle shared his thoughts on McGinnis prior to tip-off last night in Milwaukee. George McGinnis was one of my favorite players when I was growing up in high school. Um, every day we walk in our facility, we see his number in the rafters, Hall of Fame. Um, his greatness as a player is, uh, is, is unquestioned. He's one of the few guys that was a, an all-star in the ABA and the NBA. Um, and his game was, uh, was among the, the most unique in history. Uh, he's a wonderful, warm, kind man. Got to spend time with him on several occasions. And so uh, just want to send, uh, send our best to the family. Now, the Pacers said McGinnis will uh, have a private service and that a celebration of life will be held next year inside of Gamebridge Fieldhouse. Phil. AC, thank you very much. Major Joe Hogsett posted a statement on Twitter, now X, today to remember the Pacer legend, he says, from the gyms of George Washington High School and Indiana University to playing for our very own Pacers. The Hall of Famer was an American icon and basketball legend.